Let's talk about VTP communication. As you probably know, VTP is a Cisco protocol that makes it easier to configure VLANs across a large layer two domain. So to do this, switches are configured with one of four different roles. We have servers, which is a switch on which the VLANs can be created, modified, and deleted. We have clients, switches that receive configuration changes from servers and implement them locally. We have transparent, which are switches that don't want to configure VLANs based on VTP messages, but they're happy to pass those messages on to other switches. And we have off, which is the fourth one, switches that ignore VTP messages entirely. So there are three main messages that travel between switches to make this possible. Firstly, we have the summary message. This is sent every 300 seconds or whenever a VLAN is added, removed or modified. The second message type is a client request. This is a request from a client to get more information about VLANs that it wants to configure. And the third message is a subset message. This is a response to a client request with the information needed to configure that VLAN. So VTP will send messages across the link using multicast to spread this out through the network. I hope that explains a little bit more about the messages VTP uses, and I hope that is useful for you to pass your CCNP exam. We'll see you next time.